and DQ, and you get the free win. Mm -hmm. Really, it's just foolproof. But, we have Twan and the Blue One on stream right now, going on FD, Pichu and Ike. Pichu and Ike. Um, I don't want to say who has the advantage here, but at the same time, Ike's sword is like five Pichus long. Oh god, don't SD. I think Twan just saved him. I think so. I think he was like, no, I want a real match. Uh, I don't he think he knew he was dead, but <laughs> he was pretty dead. Yeah. But, that being said, Ike has some mad kill power, so like, Pichu yeah. could die near the ledge at no, this point. No, Pichu is a kill percent right now, because a, a nair up air kills at this percent. But Pichu also can gimp Ike pretty easy, or save yeah. Ike pretty easy, as you see. <laughs> like, right? If you there just go, go off stage... Wow, yeah. Thunderbolt just do that. Worked. It just yep. worked. Oh, going for the hard read with up smash. Not gonna get punished though. F tilt center stage might kill, not sure. Pichu being this light's hard to tell what's gonna kill when. Yeah, although Pichu's shield is small, I think just anything will shield poke right now. Oh yeah. Got an air, air dodges the up air, good job. Mm -hmm. I don't think. Oh! Oh wow, uh, okay. <laughs> yeah, see? Light. F tilt does get the kill. I think it was gonna work. Work. Both these players went going through their bracket really well. Winners finals here. Mm -hmm. This it's is cool. it's cool to see it's oh, like a complete no. reverse. Wow. We got the oh, saved him from the first SD, but couldn't save him from that SD. Mm -hmm. What but is going on here? Like Mark can bring it back. No, this Wait. this is an easy comeback, especially against Pichu. Yeah, we we've seen him do do we've some comebacks come already. Yeah. Oh, dash tech, the wrong way. I think he just wanted yeah pivot or er, dash F tilt. Oh, is that it? Oh yeah. Nope. Nope. Thunder Jolt might gimp. See, now he knows he has to go high. If not, he gets gimped. So I think Tuan's gonna catch on to F that tilt. pretty fast. Look at that shield! <laughs> I don't... Yeah, he... I don't know if it's a small shield or like... It's just small because Pichu's small though, you know? I, th I think it's a bit of both. <laughs> I, I feel like you could easily get shield poked, but Pichu's ears don't have hitboxes. Yeah, but as so you can say, yeah. them poking out is not a big deal. F-Tilt gonna oh, kill. Yeah. Look at that angle it sends you at too. That's Even if disgusting. uh the blue one lived, he was he wouldn't be able to come back. No. Because Ike doesn't have that good of recovery. No, he could have side b but still being... He would have been way too low to side b Yeah. Twan taking game one pretty yeah. well. Well, also there was like an SD, so I don't yeah, know. Yeah, I was about to say, except for the SD. But you have to take what you can get, you know? Do you think we're getting a character switch? Because I know the blue one plays that other characters. I think you might see the character switch to a snake, is what I wanted to say. Yeah, snake Just peach is a decent matchup. You can't uh, hit Cypher. I don't think you can go through Cypher with fair unless like every single hit hits. Okay. And I'm pretty sure you can't with up air. Nair might do it. I think it's a 9% window. Yeah, uh, something like that. You need a pretty high percent move. But Pikachu at the same time, cannot deal with it at all. No, I know he's fair. Usually doesn't get it unless you're like perfect. Um, I think his down air works. Down air would work, yeah, if he did recover from low. But usually snakes try to go a bit higher. Mm -hmm. We have to blue one in the uh, character select screen. So I think yeah, we're gonna see that snake. That's my guess. I and wanna see the snake. If I'm being truthful. And maybe Twan. And we are not seeing a snake. Okay, he changed his mind. He's like, nope, got this. <laughs> he SD'd. So. Yeah, sometimes it's just that. Like, no. Twan uh, picked the wrong one. song, so to blue one got so tilted he SD'd. <laughs> this is from to blue one himself. Wow, okay. I mean, that's a Thanks good reason. Thanks for that knowledge. We got inside player knowledge. Although this is a comfort pick. We've seen the blue one play this 
like three times in a row just earlier. So yeah, it's definitely a comfort pick. Yeah. Anytime we play friendlies, he always has his stages. His not go to. Mm -hmm. Or just random, but usually this dude. I think the big thing is the blue one needs to get a hold of Tuan's like approaching patterns. Because yeah. right now, he, he's nearing, but Tuan knows, like, I'm just gonna stay here. Like, he's right out. <laughs> he keeps doing the same thing. Ooh, he does read that he was gonna roll in, but miss spaces it. Mm -hmm. I f yeah, Tuan has really good read on what a blue one wants to do. Yeah. He's going to the spot where he thinks he'll be after, but he's just a bit misspaced. Oh, that could have been the stock right there if he went for the jab lock into F smash. Yeah, you can tell Tuan's spacing is just really good right now. Wow. Just runs up. F tilt. <laughs> it's very safe on shield. Well, not very safe, but it is pretty safe on shield. Yeah. So. It just stays out for so long. Juan is getting a lot of chances to get jab blocks, but I don't think he's really ready for them. Uh, oh, okay, right there, he's error. like, he was he's ready. Not. Yeah. He's like, I've seen it do it right before, so it could do it again. Almost lapping, it does lap him in percent. Mm -hmm. The big thing right now, the blue one is not spacing correctly. Yeah, I was just about to ask what you think he needs to do, but you just answered. Yeah, because that's the big thing. Every time he hits Pichu's shield, Pichu can just like nair or back air, and he's getting a lot of those punishes. Yeah, I feel like Tuan has really good read on what the blue one's going for, and he's avoiding like most hits really well. I think this might be a good idea, more F tilts. Yeah. Rounded, see? He does F tilts mostly when Tuan's in kill percent, or anyone's in kill percent. So, I think he could space out with it a bit more neutral yeah. if he needs. It's a good non committal yeah. option. Yeah, as you see, he's starting to see that he does need to space out Tuan. Because yeah. once Pichu gets in, you're you're getting it. Yeah, like I said, Ike's shield's like three Pichus long, so if you get the tip, you're good. Oh, goes for the jab block. I like seeing Tuan go for these, because especially online, it's harder to tech. Mm -hmm. Ooh, we're gonna see some run up F tilts from uh, young Pichu here. <laughs> he wants it, look at it. Run up. <laughs> That's what he was going for, <laughs> he knew. He waited for the air dodge, good job by uh, the blue one there. I feel like he's starting to read that Tuan's like rolling behind him a lot, so he is spacing for it. He's just barely missing it. Eruption, not oh, gonna connect. I wanna see connect. Oh yeah, see right there? He ran back before Tuan rolled and got the read. Yeah. Barely didn't kill though, but... I think though that the blue one knows that Tuan's just... was just going for um, F tilts. So he could play around that, because that's what he's going for right now. Look yeah. at him, he's grounded. Go for it, F tilt. If I were to call this, I think the game's swinging into a... The blue one's favor right here. Mm -hmm. Oh, that was. He could have just F tilt for the kill, but he waited too long and went for yeah. F tilt. I think F tilt would have shield poke. It, it wouldn't even need to. He would have just punished the end leg on down. Uh, I like smash. the patience. There we go. That was good patience. Oh, just yeah. Shield just a bit more. So it's blue one living a lot longer on this stock. Not SDing. And he's spacing a lot better. Mm -hmm. So. Tuan's really gonna have to work like, a lot harder. Yeah, he's really learned what this pattern is, especially on shield. Yeah, Tuan's go to is trying to get behind uh, the blue one and just get F tilts. But right now, <laughs> he's Mark's... been fishing for that F tilt for like yeah, you see that right forever. there. He just rolled behind, like right there again. He's rolling yeah. behind a he's lot, and away. Mark's just running back and F tilting F -tilt, every time. F -tilt. F tilt. There he got it, finally. 40%, 43%, that's not too bad. He when can this definitely. Is uploaded, someone count the F tilts before he got one. <laughs> Alright. Teach you at 60, so 87. Wow, that was a good advantage. F tilt at ledge definitely will kill Thrike. We're gonna see a lot of F tilts 
in this la remaining yeah. stock. <laughs> this is the F tilt matchup. They're just both throwing out F tilt. Dash tech not is killing. That work? Close. Eruption. Eruption. Finally. <laughs> He finally gets what wow. I haven't seen on his all oh, wow. night. We see that so much. Finally. But, yeah, that was really looking like a Twan's game right there, but the blue one bringing it back hard. Yeah. I just looked at the uh, damage. Pichu did 102% damage to himself. Wow. That's from all those death tokes. Yep. Because uh, the blue one did 284, and Pichu had 386% done to him. Who's Bandit? Bandit... Chat, stop not sure. Bandit. Apparently Bandit is now Bolt. Bolt, okay. So whoever Bandit was... Is now Bolt, but I still don't know who Bolt is. Yeah, no idea. Is <laughs> not even playing in this, right? Is no, he is. He was. Uh... Where are you at, Bolty? I seen you. I swear I did. Yeah, Bolt lost to to Blue oh, One right there. round one. That's Shucky. And then Shucky, oh, that's a really hard bracket for you, my guy. Yeah, that sucks. <laughs> that is... <laughs> <laughs> that was not the most ideal. Yeah. Oh, Kaiser made the upset over Shucky round one, which made it harder for the young Bolt, whoever you are. Oh, Bolt is PI player Richard. Okay, Richard. I think I know him. Well, good thing you do. <laughs> <laughs> Alright. Got Just this to matchup. Hit the loser's side. Uh, Catalyst takes it 2 1 over Brian. Slash Vapor. Oh, wow. But back to the match. Game 3 happening in the winner's finals. Game 3 and the Town City. That's a Party. strange pick. I did not, we haven't seen this stage yet. So, Pichu does kill off the side really well. Mm -hmm. And. But so does. I, because all the kills have been off the side. Yeah. Just the bigger stage probably is gonna help Pichu. Yeah. Even though Pokemon Stadium is still pretty big. And it's got moments like this with no platforms, and I think Pichu does, does pretty alright. Yeah. Maybe it's just a comfort pick, because it just seems to be fine for both players. Yeah. Oh, that could have been a kill confirm off that nair. Yeah, that was nasty. Didn't think he was gonna get. Right I'd like to see a uh, Tuan exploit uh, Ike's recovery a bit better, cause uh, right, right now right he's just getting it back. Yeah, but it's it is scary hard. because th there's that always that one chance you get hit by it. <laughs> yeah, it doesn't have too big of a knockback, so if you get hit by it, Ike might die. Mm -hmm. If he races double jump, he's definitely dead. Even just hitting you. Thunder. The rare uh, thunder from Tuan. Yeah, that might be the first thunder we've seen all get all set. It's all set, yeah. I'm pretty sure it was, yeah. This oh. Pichu went 131%. This is crazy. Does Ike still have his kill throw in this game? I'm not sure. Yeah, I, I haven't seen Ike him. Ike has have a to hard time it. grabbing in this game. Yeah, but it's still an okay. Nice F tilt yeah. off the side there. Pichu One could not run away fast wild. enough. That's gonna kill. Yeah. Two quick kills on both sides. Yeah, really he's really close. close to the blast zone already. So, this game's really setting up to be very close. I'm glad uh, to Blue One got a read on what Tuan was doing. Now we yeah. get a really close game three. I think they're both very confident on each other right now. They know what they're doing. Oh, 100%. Yeah. Oh, nice grab. I didn't think that would grab. Went for the spike. Oh, went for Tied the up smash. The jabs. Pichu jabs are always funny if they're not jab locking. Because <laughs> it's just like, one, two, three, hit butts. Stay away from me. It's like surprisingly good shield pressure too for some reason. Yeah. <laughs> Alright, so Twan racking up a lot of percent onto the blue one here. 
Mm -hmm. Pop shield early, that's scary. He went for the edge guard, but a bit too late. F till. That's good. Oh, there we go. Did he, he touch? Knew. Okay, he did touch the ground. If he didn't have yeah. jump, he was dead. Oh god. Yeah. Okay, he's dead. Yeah, that was a nice to see, like actual edge guarding. He got a. He got his pattern down on his side B. Yeah. So, this Twan lived to 150 on his first stock, so. Mark's gonna have to do a lot better job kill. Okay, yeah, he went for up smash. That was gonna yeah, kill early. That was crazy. Does say he's gonna have to kill earlier than that if he wants to bring it back. <laughs> Alright, let's. See. Oh. Yeah, if he wants this game, he has to, like, take no percent from now on. Like, 60% is already pretty a lot against Pichu. Oh, yeah. But spawn with a thunder Look at that frame. tiny Skittle shield. Oh my god, this what, he's just throwing out the Thunder Jones, <laughs> racking up the percent here. Yeah, he's playing the long game, he knows. Oh, platform helps and hinders Ike. Oh, oh you're dead! Oh, yeah, that's dead. That's, that's nice over. game 3 from Tuan. Yeah, good, good stuff from Tuan. Two stocks.